So who inspires me and what, what do I get inspired by? That's a question. Uh, so first to get into that, I think I have to talk about what's inspiration to me. Um, for me, inspiration is feeling like you have a map or like you know where you want to go or you know where you are on the map. It's basically not being lost. And it's also this place where new ideas are coming up effortlessly and naturally. Um, or you feel like you're, if it's not an idea or creative um, mental space that you're in, if it's more like art or like athletics or dancing, it's like, it's, it's all just coming up naturally and you don't have to try. Um, and to me, some of the biggest things, the biggest places I get inspired are like, working on a team and solving problems together or coming up with new ideas, new strategies together, or just being creative together. Um, so that, that shared vision space to me is, is closely linked with inspiration. Um, and, and some other places where I get inspired is, is, uh, is doing art. And that's something I do by myself. And so usually when I wanna do art, it's because I get to a dead end in the rest of my life and I'm totally uninspired with what I'm doing and I need to just stop, let it all go and work through it, um, through art and find, um, it's almost like if I'm frustrated, I just need to drop it, do art and then through that process I become inspired again and then I might even go and work on like a project plan or something like that afterwards. Um, another thing that inspires me is dancing because <clears throat> all the answers are already within you and you're just like letting it, letting it come out and you're not even like, there's no filter. Like you're just letting it fly and some crazy stuff comes out. And, and I think like you might just start doing something and you might screw up and then you turn that into something that looks like you did it on purpose. Um, and so in to be it that only happens when you're inspired and you're able to just like slipstream that energy into a different direction um so people that inspire me um people that don't care what other people think and they they just go for what they know to be true within them. And then as they do that more and more, it be, people recognize, wow, that's amazing what that person's doing. Um, <clears throat> that's inspiring to me because it allows me to let go of the voice of judgment in my head that says, you know, somebody else is not gonna think this is valuable or they're gonna think this is crazy or whatever. And I can just like let that go and focus on what's unique uh, that's coming out of me and that's you need to be able to let go of that voice to be able to allow the inspiration to bubble up because um, that voice of judgment is trying to like push down new thoughts um, I'm trying to think of exact people um, I think people who just like carve their own thing and people who make up a new job description for themselves that like makes that's just like perfect for them um, and create a whole new, maybe even industry that's like <laughs> made for them. Um, so that's inspiring to me. Uh, also skateboarding is another thing for me. Like when I feel frustrated, I'll go skateboard. And um, that's about getting in the flow. So like the positive psychology stuff and um, you need rapid feedback. And so skateboarding is really good for rapid feedback because you'll go and try it with trick and you'll screw it up and you have to like get into different headspace try it again um, and also there's this thing about committing so like a lot of tricks I know that I could do them but I just don't have the balls I'll just like ah, I'm gonna fall down six stairs and so you keep trying it but you're not really committing fully and you screw it up because you're not actually gonna you're not actually trying to throw it so when you really commit fully it's like yeah you might break the board and hit your nuts on a rail but you're probably not going to so, um, yeah, skateboarding is crazy because it really shows you that your own fear of, of failure is the only thing stopping you from failing. 
or it's the only thing that's stopping you from succeeding. So your own fear of, fear of failure is the only thing that's creating that failure. Um, and that we can do a lot of stuff, but we're just blocking ourselves from doing it because we won't commit to it. Um, yeah, so in, for, to me, inspiration is being in a state where you don't have to think and you don't have to figure it out. You don't have to try. You're just like, everything is there. You don't have to, you don't have to try to access some thought over here and remember something. It's all just right there and you can add new things to it and things stack up and you're like, oh, this works perfectly because it does this, 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 and this at the same time. And when you're inspired, you can see all those things in one place. Um, so that's it.